Greetings everyone, this is Sonny with uh, Toward Zero, Indianapolis, uh, Noblesville. I want to real quick uh, show how to export the PLC tags in the Studio 5000 platform. Uh, we can export our tag database into a CSV file and then we can use all the power of Excel to uh, look at and manipulate those tags. So um, the export function is under tools. So I got my program open here. Um, I'm offline. You don't have to be online uh, to do this. Uh, so we click tools and right here is an export option. We want to export our tags and logic comments. When I do that, it's going to pop up and ask me where I want to put the files. I'll just keep it in the uh, default location where I saved the last time I used this and then we'll just keep the uh, we can change the name but we'll just keep the same name the default name that's associated with the uh, uh, controller name uh, so let's uh, click export we're going to do it as a CSV file it also gives the option of a text file but we're going to keep it CSV so let's hit export uh, this program is pretty small so that was really quick um, but let's see what we got so here we can see where my save location was I have the uh, name I used and uh, for the CSV file and let's check it out in Excel so right here um, all my tags that were in the PLC it tells what type scope name any descriptors associated with it data types and uh, other information uh, like the radix and uh, whether it's read write and basically the properties for the tag um, so here what we're mainly interested in is the name so here's the name of all my tags in column C and then uh, if I keep going down you can see the scope when the scope changes um, the blank ones like uh, are in the controller scope the PL, the processor scope and then these here are in the the program scope so these particular ones are in main program and if I keep going you can see the scope changes as the properties of the tags change and then here I have the descriptors so that's uh, exporting your PLC tags into a CSV file and then you can use the power of Excel to do whatever you might need to do to those tags. So, thanks everyone.